Today we show you step by step how to upgrade your macOS to macOS Monterey. Hello and welcome to Levin's Review. I'm David and thank you so much for joining us. If you are new in the channel, we have great reviews, tips and tricks, step-by-step -step tutorials and everything you need to know to make the most out of a product. So please click the like and subscribe button and let's start. Lately, Apple released a new macOS, Monterey. Monterey has a new feature that makes the workflow so easy and efficient. Also, Apple significantly improved the integration of macOS with the rest of Apple devices, and that is a huge advantage for people who own few Apple devices. But if you are still wondering if it's worth the upgrade, I recommend you to watch our video Monterey Top 5 New Features. I will put a link up here. Before we start, I want to show you which computers are fully compatible with the new macOS Monterey. Take a look at the following list. Also, I'll put link to the list in the description down below. First of all, pay attention to the free space requirement. So make sure you have enough space on your hard drive. In my experience, the installation was really smooth, but in any case, I always recommend to back up all your important data that you have on your computer. Okay, after we made sure that our computer is compatible with the new macOS, and we back up all our important data, let's start the installation. Click on the Apple logo and select About This Mac. Now click Software Update. By the way, if you're using laptop, this is the time to connect the laptop to electricity. After a minute, you will see suggestion to upgrade to macOS Monterey. Click Upgrade now. The download process is start and it can take a while. After the download process is finished, you will see the following message. Press Upgrade now, Continue, Agree, and once again, Agree. If you have more than one hard drive, select the hard drive you want for the installation of the macOS and click continue. Once again click continue, enter your password and click unlock. The installation process will start and that will take a while. In the end of the installation you will be required to reboot your computer. Click on restart. The restart process also will take a while. And that's it, your new macOS Monterey is ready to use. Guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you like it and you find it helpful, please click the like button and subscribe to the channel. If you have any comments or questions, let me know in the comments down below. I wish you a beautiful day and of course, I will see you in the next video.